Welcome to this session on implementing the CIS 3.0 Implementation Group 3 benchmark for Windows Server 2022 through Group Policy. In this presentation, we'll go step by step, from preparing your environment to applying the GPO, validating it, and finally verifying compliance using CIS-CAT and Microsoft tools. By the end, you'll understand how to bring your servers to an enterprise-grade hardened state aligned with CIS standards. The Centre for Internet Security, or CIS, provides globally recognised benchmarks for securing systems and software. CIS benchmarks define specific configurations that help reduce vulnerabilities and harden the system. Implementation groups IG1, IG2 and IG3 allow organisations to apply controls based on their size and risk exposure. Our focus today is IG3, which targets enterprise level protection and advanced security posture. CIS classifies controls into three levels. IG1 is basic security hygiene, ideal for small organisations. IG2 offers intermediate hardening, suitable for medium-sized environments. IG3 is the most advanced, focusing on enterprises with high-value assets or sensitive data. This tiered structure helps tailor security investments appropriately. Group policy is the most effective native tool for applying consistent configurations across Windows environments. It allows centralised control, minimises human error and ensures compliance at scale. Using GPOs, you can enforce security settings that cannot be easily altered by end users, maintaining uniform CIS compliance. Before beginning, ensure you have an Active Directory domain controller with Group Policy Management Console installed. Administrative access is required to create and link policies. You'll also need the official CIS benchmark for Windows Server 2022, preferably Level 2, and tools like Microsoft Policy Analyzer or CISCAT for verification. Visit the official CIS portal and download the Windows Server 2022 Level 2 benchmark. You'll receive documentation in PDF format, along with configuration guidance and mapping files. These documents define registry paths and policy recommendations used throughout this implementation. Open Group Policy Management Console. Create a new policy named CISWS 2022 IG3 and select Edit. This will serve as the main GPO for applying all CIS configurations across your domain. It's a best practice to separate CIS hardening policies from general administrative ones for better change tracking. In account policies, enforce strong passwords, at least 14 characters with complexity enabled. Set the lockout threshold to five attempts with a 15 minute duration. These simple but crucial settings protect against brute force and password guessing attacks. Enable detailed auditing under Advanced Audit Policy configuration. Track logon events, privilege use and policy changes. This creates valuable logs for detecting suspicious activity and performing forensic investigations. Use this section to control who can log on locally or remotely. For example, deny local logon and network access to guests while allowing only administrators. These privileges significantly affect system security and must align with least privilege principles. Under security options, disable outdated authentication protocols like LM and NTLMv1. In negligence SMB signing to prevent tampering, restrict anonymous access and enforce control plus alt plus delete at logon for better security. 
These hardening steps close common attack vectors. Ensure Microsoft Defender antivirus is active and that real-time protection is enabled. Activate all three firewall profiles, domain, private and public. These controls meet CIS requirements the baseline endpoint defence and reduce malware exposure. Adjust log sizes to at least 196,608 kilobytes and enable retention with backup before overwrite. This ensures important security events are not lost and are available for future audits or investigations. Well-configured logging is critical for compliance evidence. Once all configurations are complete, link the GPO to the desired organizational unit. Run GP update slash force on target servers to enforce policies immediately. Then generate a GP result slash hreport.html to verify successful application. Use Microsoft Policy Analyzer or Syscat Pro Assessor to verify compliance. These tools compare your server's configuration against Sys benchmarks and identify deviations. You'll receive a compliance score and a list of failed checks to address. Schedule weekly or monthly compliance reports and store them securely. Track any GPO changes and maintain version logs for audit purposes. This documentation serves as proof during compliance reviews or internal assessments. Security isn't static. Review and update your GPO as CIS releases new benchmarks. Always back up GPOs using Backup GPO and restore when needed using Restore GPO. Maintaining version control ensures you can quickly recover from misconfigurations. Always test GPO changes in a staging environment before applying them in production. Log all changes, obtain approvals and monitor configurations through a centralised SIEM. These practices ensure security and operational stability. Use CIS benchmark PDFs as your baseline reference. Microsoft's Security Compliance Toolkit and PowerShell commandlets like Get GPO Report, Backup GPO and Restore GPO help automate reporting and recovery. CISCAT remains the primary compliance verification tool. CIS-CAT Pro is developed by CIS to assess compliance automatically. It evaluates your system against benchmark settings and provides a percentage score. Its reports are crucial for continuous monitoring and audit readiness. CIS-CAT Pro is developed by CIS to assess compliance automatically. It evaluates your system against benchmark settings and provides a percentage score. Its reports are crucial for continuous monitoring and audit readiness. Here's an example of a typical report. Out of 450 checks, 430 passed and 20 failed, giving a 95.5% compliance rate. Aim for at least 90% compliance, but remember that even a few failed items can pose risks and should be corrected. After any system or policy change, rerun CIS-CAT to verify continued compliance. Automate assessments where possible and maintain a compliance level above 90%. This ensures ongoing protection and aligns with continuous security improvement practices. Security is a continuous journey. Monitor CIS and Microsoft updates regularly and update your policies accordingly. Retrain your administrators to understand new CIS controls and how to apply them effectively. CIS 3.0 provides a strong, structured approach to securing enterprise systems. By using group policy, we centralise and enforce these settings efficiently. Regular auditing and validation are key to maintaining compliance and minimising risk. Finally, use this checklist as your quick reference for the entire CIS 3.0 implementation process.
it summarises all major steps, from downloading benchmarks to validating compliance. Following this structured approach ensures your Windows Server 2022 environment stays secure, compliant and audit ready. CIS 3.0 provides a strong, structured approach to securing enterprise systems. By using group policy, we centralise and enforce these settings efficiently. Regular auditing and validation are key to maintaining compliance and minimising risk. Finally, use this checklist as your quick reference for the entire CIS 3.0 implementation process. It summarises all major steps, from downloading benchmarks to validating compliance. Following this structured approach ensures your Windows Server 2022 environment stays secure, compliant and audit ready. CIS 3.0 provides a strong, structured approach to securing enterprise systems. By using group policy, we centralise and enforce these settings efficiently. Regular auditing and validation are key to maintaining compliance and minimising risk. Finally, use this checklist as your quick reference for the entire CIS 3.0 implementation process. It summarises all major steps, from downloading benchmarks to validating compliance. Following this structured approach ensures your Windows Server 2022 environment stays secure, compliant and audit ready. CIS 3.0 provides a strong, structured approach to securing enterprise systems. By using group policy, we centralise and enforce these settings efficiently. Regular auditing and validation are key to maintaining compliance and minimising risk. Finally, use this checklist as your quick reference for the entire CIS 3.0 implementation process. It summarises all major steps, from downloading benchmarks to validating compliance. Following this structured approach ensures your Windows Server 2022 environment stays secure, compliant and audit ready. CIS-CAT Pro is developed by CIS to assess compliance automatically. It evaluates your system against benchmark settings and provides a percentage score. Its reports are crucial for continuous monitoring and audit readiness. Here's an example of a typical report. Out of 450 checks, 430 passed and 20 failed, giving a 95.5% compliance rate. Aim for at least 90% compliance, but remember that even a few failed items can pose risks and should be corrected. After any system or policy change, rerun CIS-CAT to verify continued compliance. Automate assessments where possible and maintain a compliance level above 90%. This ensures ongoing protection and aligns with continuous security improvement practices. Security is a continuous journey. Monitor CIS and Microsoft updates regularly and update your policies accordingly. Retrain your administrators to understand new CIS controls and how to apply them effectively. CIS 3.0 provides a strong, structured approach to securing enterprise systems. By using group policy,